holder of the northern light. In Kenai, Alaska, go to the highest point possible, be it a hill or the roof of a building. Bring a weapon, preferably something powerful. There you will meet a man of thirty-five with short grey hair. He wears pants, boots, a trench coat, and a hat, all black. In his right hand is a folded black umbrella. He will look at you. The smile he gives you will be unnerving, his glacier blue eyes staring straight into the depths of your already tortured soul. He will remark about how nice the weather is. Do not agree with him. Instead, say, It's a little hot for me. Upon hearing this, his already eerie smile will intensify, his eyes narrowing in satisfaction. As he opens his umbrella, you will begin to notice the snow that falls around you is falling much harder than it was, and that the temperature has dropped significantly. Eventually, you and he will be the only ones left, staring out into a vast field of white. The sea itself is completely frozen, and the land around you has begun to transform, turning from city streets into bare, cold wilderness. The man will look up at the sky and smile. Above is the aurora in all its beauty. Look deep inside of it. To simply admire it is not enough, and you would have wasted your visit. Study it as if it were the most fascinating thing you have ever laid eyes upon. If you still fail to notice something odd, then thank the man and walk away. When you return to civilization, get rid of whatever objects you may already have. Give them to other seekers, destroy them, whatever you deem to be fit. You are not the one to reunite them, and your effort has gone to waste. Go on with your normal life, if it still exists. If you are a true seeker, one of the few there are, then you will notice an anomaly in the maze of lights, a small door made of translucent light, sits in the aurora's centre. Acknowledge its presence by nodding and saying, I see the way to broken dreams. Please note that nothing will happen if you say this without seeing the door. If you truly see the door, and you feel calm, a stairway of scintillating colours will lead towards it. Take the stairs. The walk will be long, tiring, and cold. Press on. The knowledge that you are truly one of the chosen is precious enough to drive you forward. Do not stop, lest the holder change his mind. Eventually you will reach the door. Open it with a clear mind and a calm expression. Inside is a small floating island of ice. The man will be waiting for you, his hat tilted to hide his eyes. Nod respectfully towards him and offer your hand. What happens next is his decision. If he disapproves of you, then ready your weapon. His umbrella instantly freezes anything it touches and it is going to be used against you shortly. However, if he believes you are truly worthy of your title, he will shake your hand, leaving in it a small, transparent crystal. The inside of the crystal dances with the exotic colours of the northern lights themselves. Thank the man and walk out the door. You will find yourself outside of a cafe near your home. The crystal is object 206 of 538. When the lights come forth once more, 
the end will be nigh.